Hello everybody, it's Tracy. Okay, so welcome to what I am calling right now my crafty vlog. <laughs> so I'm just going to really talk about some crafty stuff. Um, yeah, I don't really have anyone like right <clears throat> who lives near me who really cares about this kind of stuff. So I figured I would talk to you on YouTube. Yeah. And um so anyway, I just I was just sitting here and I'm looking at this mess. Look at my desk and I'm like this is just ridiculous. How did it get like this? I just don't understand it. Um, I'm just, I don't know, I'm feeling a little overwhelmed, and it's just a messy desk, it's not that bad, really, but, I don't know. Okay, so, um, let me show you what I have on my desk, because I just feel like talking about it. <laughs> so, last night, um, I, well, yesterday, I got this idea that I should make a mini album right so well it really started the day before because on Thursday I went to Michael's and I found a few little things it wasn't this is not like a big haul or anything but I found this and um I thought oh yeah I need to make a mini album and when I was in Michael's I was looking for fall things like fall scrapbook items <clears throat> well they have all of the <clears throat> excuse me all of the um Halloween stuff out but I don't see any fall stuff and I love fall fall is like my favorite season and I just don't understand how a one day holiday such as Halloween gets racks and racks full of stuff but a whole season fall does not I just don't get it I don't understand that you know I have nothing against Halloween it's a fun holiday <laughs> but it's just one day and fall is a whole season fall should at least get a rack of stuff right but no anyway <clears throat> so this is what I found I actually have some of these from previous years they came in a different kind of packaging but I love those I'm same with this okay and I decided to get these but see one thing about the Halloween stuff I noticed is that it's basically the same stuff what is up with that it's like basically the same as last year and I have that stuff which is fine because that means that I won't be buying the stuff from Michaels this year which means I can buy different stuff right so anyway <clears throat> back to fall so I did find these on Thursday and I said oh I need to make a fall mini album um, I really don't need new fall stuff anyway because I have a ton of it already and I can make one so I got these and these this was a dollar ninety nine a dollar ninety nine I did use my 40% off coupon but when I got home I look at it and I'm like how many are in here it is four you guys four four pieces in here all right for $1.99 really remember back in the day like I'll show you this old one that I dug out back in the day you got five pages and this was only 99 cent or a dollar now they have doubled the price and they have taken away a page really crazy so I got that then yesterday I went back because I don't know why I just happened to be around there and I thought oh I should go to Michael's again and this is what I bought yesterday I got this um <clears throat> stuff it's called craft cord and I guess it's kind of like the floss and I got it for blessings <clears throat> because I'm always trying to 
I don't know what happened I had a whole bunch of floss like lots of colors with my so when I had my so easy stuff we are memory keepers but I gave that all to my daughter so she has them so anyway I got these and this was $3.99 use a coupon on that and then I bought this and I paid regular price for this $1.99 because what I'm thinking is maybe when I make my mini album I'll use both of these and then when I um dug this out I said I can add that to it because those are all like fall things right <sighs> I don't know <sighs> I don't even know if I'm going to even get around to um making this album but I don't know, I don't know. so anyway so yeah I just have receipts here I'm keeping the receipts because if I don't make this album I'm returning this stuff if I feel like oh I'm just not gonna do it I'm returning I'm not keeping it why because I have enough chipboard stuff that I have collected over the years and that I never used so I don't need to keep this stuff whatever <clears throat> so now oh I went to Ulta this has nothing to do with crafting, but I did go to Ulta and I bought some um, nail polish. They had OPI nail polish for four dollars and four and twenty-five cents, and six dollars and twenty-five cents, and that is really good because OPI nail polish is not cheap. <clears throat> and that's what I went to get. I went to buy a bottle of OPI nail polish. I ended up getting three because they were so cheap. Anyway, so these are little calendar things um that I'm going to make calendars with this is stuff that I bought like a couple of weeks ago it's a swivel knife and I hope that this thing really works well because I have an array of craft knives and yet they always seem to fail me eventually what is it with the blades not staying in the knife I mean they move around they come out it's just crazy so hopefully this will work out better have some ribbon oh isn't she adorable i hope i get to work with her in a couple soon i have her out let's see what else do i have over here on my table oh i just moved that over it's my phone oh this is just like you know how when you um you want to do a test stamp <laughs> so that's what that is a test yeah for test stamping some stuff that I used on projects chart more stamps oh look okay this isn't that cool? It's a big T. It was only $1.49 on clearance. I don't know what I'm going to do with it, but I liked it. And then I got these in the mail. These Uptown Girls. Where's the other one? These three came in the mail for me. Aren't they cute? I love the Uptown Girls by Stamping Bella. Love them. I got them for half off at, um... Joann's. So those came the other day. So of course that's all in the junk pile. I have stuff here that I used on my last project. I have, yeah, just stuff. Oh look, isn't this washi tape cute? I love it. I think it's so pretty. And I'm not a big washi tape person, but I just thought it was pretty, so I bought it. Yeah. <clears throat> so anyway. And that's what's on my table today it is a mess everything's a mess I want to make something but I have to clean up my mess first and I don't feel like cleaning up the mess so that must mean I don't feel like making something <laughs> I don't know but yeah I wanted to show you my massive amount of um, craft I'm um, not craft but fall stuff and Halloween stuff okay Ugh, I don't know if you can see I can't see what you can see so here are my some of my boxes of 
Halloween and fall things there. But see, that's not it. I have stuff like way back there, like about four more boxes, which you can even see. Um, next time, I'll just bring them all out to show you. Because right now it's just too much. I just can't deal with it. pulling that stuff out and holding the camera. Um, these are some magazines. Is this old or new? I don't know. Oh no, this is the newest one. Sorry, you probably didn't even see it. Yeah, and here are my um, UK magazines. I love these magazines. I just do. Of course, when I get them, they're always like a month old. Like, they're late, but I don't care. I just love them. <clears throat> and I have to find a place for them. Because I have grown out of my original spot where I keep my magazines like and a couple of months ago I did a big purge and I um just got rid of like so many magazines that I had from over the years I just decided it's just ridiculous for me to keep them I don't have space like that I just don't and it was taking up so much space so I went through and I just kept the ones that I really really loved and I just dumped the rest of those magazines in the recycling bin yeah yeah I know I know I could have given them away or whatever <clears throat> but you know sometimes it's just more trouble than it's worth to go through all of that you know and like if you want to give stuff away to people who don't live near you you have to pay for shipping and stuff um no I'm not doing that for a whole bunch of stuff. So what I end up doing a lot of time is I will send all my stuff to the Goodwill. So people around here who shop at the Goodwill, <laughs> they end up getting some good stuff because most of my things that I don't want, my crafty things, I send to Goodwill. And... um only time I de-stash is if it's something, you know, that's kind of, that's valuable and small enough to ship, then I'll do a de-stash every now and then. But for the most part, if I want to get rid of stuff, I just send it to the Goodwill or I just chuck it. Or my daughter, my middle daughter will take, she takes a lot of my stuff. Um... But her room is kind of full of stuff. She's becoming a crafty pack rat. So I'm trying to help her. <laughs> oh, anyway. I think that my little chat is probably over for today. And you're probably getting tired of looking at my messy desk anyway. And you guys might think that this video is crazy, so we'll see, because if you guys hate it, then I won't do another one. I'll just chat to myself like I normally do. But anyway, everybody, thanks for watching, and um, maybe I'll see you again for another crafty vlog. Alright, bye.